welcome everyone uh, in today's prediction gameplay between Brentford and Arsenal and this match will be the prediction gameplay uh, while Brentford playing at their home uh, here at the GTEC Community Stadium against Arsenal who has been brilliant in this uh, in this season uh, at the second position of the table here Arsenal starting this match here today and Brentford uh, in the ninth position here and we shall see who will be winning the match if uh, Arsenal gets uh, today's victory they shall reach back at the top of the table and that is a good fight at the top by, between Manchester City and Arsenal here is Brentford's lineup here Ken Lewis, uh, Tony Mbiomo at the forward here David Rai at the back Henry maybe and uh, there is Rico Henry, Bien Me, Johnson, and Aaron Hickey at the back. Here is Arsenal's lineup. Gabriel Jesus at the front. Martin Ali, Martin Norigard, Bukayo Saka, Granit Saka, Lokongo Zinchenko, Gabriel Magalhaes, William Saliba, Ben White, and at the back, Aaron Ramsdale. The normal lineup. Uh, here is uh, Mikel Arteta playing with his own lineup here, his normal lineup. Uh, and kicking off the match here, the first half, Brentford. Here is uh, Jensen. Passes on for Baptiste. Here is Baptiste. Shadon Baptiste has been robbed off. Here is Gabriel Jesus with the ball with some nice rainbow flick above the defender. Here is Bukayo Saka. And couldn't find back Gabriel Jesus there. Here is uh, Panson. Now here comes Shadon Baptiste. Here is Ivan Tony. Here is Janelt. Taken away, Arsenal once again in possession. Gabriel Jesus to Martin Odegaard, who tries to take a shot. And it will be well blocked. And here is Jensen. Passes on. Here is Janelt. Back to Jensen. Jensen here with the pass for Baptiste. Baptiste trying to make a pass. Here is a foul on Baptiste here. And we shall see the replay once again. Uh, referee quick to call that as a foul on uh, Shandon Baptiste and the... Uh, uh, kick has been provided not so happy here with the referee's decision Martinelli looking for some excuse against the referee here is Jansen Pontus Jansen crosses it for Kian Luiz headers it for Tony but uh, William Saliba will get it comfortably back for Arsenal and here is uh, William Saliba back again passes on for Gabriel's Magalhaes Passes back to Zinchenko. Here is Zinchenko. Coming up, up front uh, from the right. Here is Martinelli. Passes it for Martin Odegaard. That's a back pass for oh, Gabriel Jesus. But that was nicely read by the Brentford defence. Here is a chance. Uh, Ivan Tony with the ball. But couldn't get past William Saliba. Nicely defended there. I hope you guys are enjoying our prediction gameplay. Do not forget to uh, put your comments about this match's prediction in our comment section. We would love to watch your predictions as well. Here is Janel getting the ball back for his team. Here is Brentford on the run. But Gabriel Maglacius will get it off. And Arsenal back uh, in the attacking end. Here is Lokombo to Martin Odegaard. Back to Granit Chaka. Here is Granit Chaka dispossessed but won it back easily. Gabriel Maglacius. Passes on for Zinchenko here. There is a pass for Martinelli. Couldn't reach there. And clearance still. Jensen here is Martinelli once again disposes to Martin Odegaard. Will get it back for Lokongo. Lokongo's pass uh, blocked away. Here is Kian Lewis reaching the ball. But Ben White was easily there. Positioned well with the defense here is Granit Chaka. Arsenal leaving no signs of relief here for the Brentford team. Here is a chance. Gabriel. Jesus takes on the shot on his shoulders but misses it. That was a good effort from that uh, from Gabriel Jesus. And this kind of efforts will be much more uh, in the upcoming minutes here. And uh, Brentford should be clinging, clinching on with a narrow uh, passing football here uh, in the defense. Position we can see 63% position kept by Arsenal here at the beginning of this first half. 20 second minutes on the board here is uh, Hickey. Aaron Hickey to Mbuomo. Mbuomo dispossessed by Zinchenko. Here is Martinelli. Passes on for Gabriel Jesus. Martin Odegaard with the ball here. Tries to make the cross uh, and here is Jansen. Get it back to Henry. Here is Rico Henry. Back to David Raya. Who clears it up. 
for Ivan Toni. Back to Janelt. There is Kiwan Lewis. Couldn't get the white ball here. Ben White will get it cleared. Brentford have won five of their six home league games against Arsenal, including a 2-0 victory in, their, in this exact fixture last season. Will be they able to repeat with a late, late victory? That was a shot blocked away clearly. Mbiamu. Mbiamu with the ball back to Baptiste. Baptiste's pass for Ivan Toni with nice turn. Mbiamu with some space here to make the through pass. But Granit Xhaka will get it clinical there. Baptiste wins the ball back for Brentford. Here is a through pass for Mbuemo. Mbuemo crosses on for Ivan Toni who is just in space. And Brentford with the lead at the 32nd minute of the match. What a cross there. Lovely done from the Brentford midfielder. He just, uh, Mbuemo just perfectly set up the ball in front of the goal penalty area. And what a clinical finish from Ivan Tony. Brentford with a very unexpected lead against Arsenal at their home, which is G Tech uh, Community Stadium. That is a lovely uh, pass. What an assist and what a clinical finish just over Aaron Ramsdale's head. He just chipped it inside the net. What a shot that is. And the assist is just way too good. What a tap in that is from Ivan Tony putting his team in lead. Arsenal have won four of their last six meetings with Brentford in all competitions. Uh, having won just one of their first nine against the Bees between 1902 and 1983. That is a certain record that can be broken here inside the BTEC Community Stadium at uh, Brentford. Mbuemo, the assist maker, once again with the ball. But this time he couldn't get past Gabriel uh, Miguelius Martinelli. It is Martin Odegaard on the run. Passes on for Bukayo Saka. There is Gabriel Jesus. Dropped away. They're beautifully done by Aaron Hickey. There's a pass this time. Ben White will get it cleared for Bukayo Saka. Ben White uh, through passes on for Gabriel Jesus, who couldn't get past Jansen there. Once again, Pontus Jansen and Rico Henry playing a very important role in the defense of the Brentford team. A uh, bit better position from uh, the Brentford side here uh, after uh, 41 minutes of the match. Here is a pass, but this time Gabriel Miguelius will get it back for Zinchenko. Back to Granit Xhaka. Here's the through pass for Gabriel Jesus. Can Arsenal get back right at the end of the first half here? Is Martin Odegaard. Through passes for Bukayo Saka. There is the space they need. But once again, Rico Henry this time. What a lovely block there. And Jansen will get it back to David Raya who clears it. And that should be the story of the first half. Uh, and we shall see the first half ending with Brentford. A uh, one Arsenal nil. That is quite an unexpected lineup. Uh, if we keep in mind the current Arsenal from form that we have witnessed in the beginning of this season. The stats after this first half are as follows. The predicted stats that shows possession for 54% for Arsenal, 46% for Brentford. Shots on target, three shots taken by Arsenal, two on the target, one for Brentford. And that was the killer for the first half. Arsenal needs some uh, magic in the second half. They need to get more composed with their attacking. They are losing much balls in the forward build-up play. That is where they need to be clinical. And we shall start our second half here at the community stadium here at Brentford. There is Bren White. Arsenal kicking off the second half here. Granit Xhaka, no substitutions yet in the after the beginning of the second half. Here is a mistake. That is Mbuemo with the ball. Brentford, nice pushed back away. That is nice defending by the Arsenal side. The Gunners are back in play. Here is Bukayo Saka. Pressure by Rico Henry. Lovely done by Rico Henry. And he gets the ball back comfortably. Here is me. Ben me. Baptiste. Here is Aaron Haiki. Mbuemo. There is Mbuemo who has been fouled there by Martin Odegaard. I think uh, we shall see. Yes, that is a stern lecture from the referee. No cards yet uh, from this man. 
and it was Zinchenko who committed the foul. I uh, excuse me, there was an update here. And here is uh, the first substitution, Tomias who comes on, replacing Ben White. Here is a cross by Mbuemo. And that's it for Rico Henry. Here is the ball for Brentford. Getting past Martin Odegaard. Once again, a foul committed by Martin Odegaard this time. And this is, uh, once again, this time Rico Henry was fouled here by Martin Odegaard. That is a late clinch on this uh, defender, Rico Henry. And again, a free kick here this time, taking on the free kick. Vitali Virudanan, what a shot that is! Just off the bar post, the woodwork denies. That should have been a masterclass. The best goal Van Roald has ever scored since today. This is a chance here. David Raya clears it off comfortably for Ivan Toni. That is uh, Van Holt who was who just took a cracker of a shot from the midfield almost. Martin Odegaard. Here is Martinelli. There is some space. Here is Gabriel Jesus. Will he get it for the Arsenal team? Back pass for Martin Odegaard. He has the time and space. But David Raya's line of defense is just as clear as uh, water there is Aaron Hickey. Hickey once again passes on for Patton Benson. There is Baptiste back to Ben Mee. Ben Mee passes on for Jensen. Here is Pawantas Jensen. Here is Rico Henry. Kiana Lewis. Arsenal gets the ball back. Lokongo back to Martin Odegaard. Here is Arsenal moving on the forward. Gabriel Jesus couldn't get it controlled. Ben Mee will get it safely for Mikey. Shandon Bartitiste's ball, uh, here is a block, here is Gabriel Jesus. Once again, Panton Jansen has got it clearly for Brentford. 65 minutes on the board. Brentford is still leading the goal score line with one uh, nil to Arsenal. Here is Ivan Tone, dispossessed by Granit Xhaka. No, here is Jensen, Jensen's cross for Bernard who gets it beautifully done. And what scenes at this stadium here? Brantford's men by Vitali. Janet has got it. The lead the doubled here for Brentford. What a cross once again from the midfield. Straight at the forward line. Beating the defense of Arsenal here at the GTEC Community Stadium. We shall see the replay here. What a cross. What a cross this time. Vanel was just in position, no offside given. And that is it here at the GD Community Stadium here. Brentford with a 2-0 lead against Arsenal. What a way to uh, uh, finish their uh, EPL league match before the uh, break. The, the, the international break is about to come and what a way to uh, finish, uh, start off the international break. Here is Eden smith coming on, replacing Lokonga, who has been a bit uh, dizzy in the uh, game here since uh, opening stages of the match. We couldn't find him, uh, Lokonga, with his positions. Here is Granit Xhaka. Passes on for Eden smith -Rowe. Here is Martin Odegaard for Gabriel Jesus, who turns successfully, takes the shot! And he is denied by the Woodwalk. The best uh, Arsenal could have created here till now and it has been denied by the goalpost. The woodwork has been a devil in many, many uh, important games for many, many uh, big, big players here in this football ground. David Raya takes the shot pass for Panton Jansen. There is Baptiste. Fights with the Arsenal forward and gets it safely for Rico Henry. Through passes it for Kiana Luis, gets it for Tomayasu. There is Bukayo Saka, passes on for Martin Odegaard, turns here is space. Gabriel Jesus on troll. There is the shot from Gabriel Jesus. And finally, the breakthrough for Arsenal. They might be coming back into this match right at the 73rd minute. Out of nowhere, there is the goal. What Martin Odegaard knew he was there. No man was marking Gabriel Jesus and you cannot make a mistake of not marking Gabriel Jesus inside the penalty area. He is absolutely clinical there to get that one goal for his team Arsenal and making a step towards coming back to this match. Uh, Brentford 
couldn't keep their calmness and composeness here at the seventh third minute. Baptiste, here is a pass for Mbuemo, who has been the creator as well as the converter for the Brentford. This uh, match here is Martinelli taking the ball back. Chance for pass. Gabriel Jesus back to Martin Odegaard. Once again, a through pass for Gabriel Jesus, who takes the shot. And this time he could not keep it under control and it is way out of the target there lovely setup there by martin odegaard once again gabriel jesus and martin odegaard linking completely perfect in the forward line and this time what a chance missed by gabriel jesus here and here comes a substitution and katia eddie and katia has come up replacing Gabriel Jesus who has done his job here is a mistake from uh, Rico Henry somehow got it back here is a pass uh, Jensen back to Pontus Jensen here is Ben Mee receives the ball passes on for Jensen here is uh, Baptiste Shandon Baptiste passes back to Panton Jensen passes back to uh, Heike here is Aaron Heike through passes for Mbuemo couldn't get the ball Zinchenko back to Granit Chaka there is Edwin Spitro passes on for Martin Odegaard Arsenal looking for that second goal to get back into this match Eddie and Ketia with some dribbling skills there but a foul has been committed from a very promising area here for Arsenal who has a clear chance in the target will they be able to convert that free kick that set piece into a goal taking on Martin Odegaard for Arsenal here. Let's see what happens here at uh, the 82nd minute of the match. Taking the shot here and what a shot that is from Martin Odegaard. He has simply brought changed the face of the match here at the 83rd minute. Arsenal coming back into this match with full force after their first goal for by uh, Gabriel Jesus and Martin Odegaard. What a strike that is. No chance, absolutely no chance for David Raya to block that shot or to get that save. Always getting away from David Raya there. What a caller, what a shot. The captain leading this team from the front, uh, Martin Odegaard, has got the second goal of the night. The most important one, the equalizer of the night here. Brentford trying to get that one laugh. They were completely perfect in Till the 73rd minute, once Gabriel Jesus opened the scoreline for Arsenal, they might just have lost some spark in their play. And here is uh, Arsenal once again getting back, trying to get back. Nice pass from Martinelli for Andy and Katia with a shot here. And Arsenal coming back into this match and winning a late, late winner here for Arsenal at the 87th minute. What a build up play from the Gunners here at the away ground what a shot and uh, Bukayo Saka was just unf so unselfish there he knew he could have to get inside with a sprint but he passes it on for Eddie and Ketia who was just clinical in his finish and here is the celebration the Arsenal has been so good this time here there is Damsgaard uh, replacing Kiana Lewis Mikkel Damsgaard and after the 82nd minute of the match, our prediction gameplay says Brentford 2, Arsenal 3 with a late, late winner. There is Martin Odegaard. Once again, there is a chance. And this time, a proper clinch, a proper tackle. No intention. That is a straight red against Jansen there. Pontus Jansen, who has been so good in the small stuff till the 70th minute but makes a huge mistake here in front of the penalty area once again the same position will Martin Odegaard get it back Benson Jansen and takes the shot and once again the same shot and once again Martin Odegaard what a night Arsenal is having here what a lovely night it is at the GTEC Community Stadium Martin Odegaard scoring two absolutely cracker absolutely brilliant goals here at the second half Arsenal scoring four goals in the second half what a sight to behold that is a proper comeback what a match we have seen here we are almost at the end of the second half the 90 minutes are almost over 
the fourth goal came right at the 90th minute. Fabio Vieira comes on replacing Martinelli. The last substitution here of the night. Advantage play. Jada Silva is here passing on for Damsgaard. Damsgaard, Nick Keegan. Damsgaard couldn't get it. Arsenal once again defending wide open. There is the sixth. Minutes of added time here. It is once again getting passed. Here is Martin Odegaard. And that is clinical Emana for the hat-trick. Martin Odegaard has scored a what a late, late hat-trick there from the captain Martin Odegaard for Arsenal. He has been brilliant in the second half. And what a lovely change is he. The amount of tacticians. Um, I think Arteta might have told Martin Odegaard to step up on the second half and he has been finding himself everywhere in this ground here. Martin Odegaard is just present there to convert it for Arsenal. And what a way to get his hat trick completed and an away fixture where they were losing after the first half with 2-0 and what a change of moments in this game of football it is just brilliant here and with a man not in their custody there Brentford is looking too weak now here is Janelt there is Jensen with the ball almost we are at the end another mistake here is Bukayo Saka taking the ball away it's just completely three versus two but Rico Henry just made it our last save there that is the story of the match here at the g tech community stadium at brentford who has been defeated by two goals to five arsenal scoring all five goals in the second half what a prediction gameplay we have here at uh, this time for you guys if you guys have enjoyed our prediction gameplay do not forget to subscribe our channel give us a like and please do let us know in the comment section who are you predicting to be the winner at the GTEC Community Stadium here? Uh, both well, best of luck to both the teams here at uh, this uh, venue for a very important match day. Arsenal, if wins, will go back into the first position, back to where they started off in this league season. And we shall see you again soon, very soon after the international break is over. Till then, I wish you all luck, guys. Uh, have a great days take care goodbye good night